change the, the vector j in Cartesian form into a magnitude along a line. The first thing you need to find is the magnitude of j, which you can do using the Pythagorean theorem. Square each of its components and take the square root. That's 8.06. So that's the magnitude. Now we need to find a line that j can lie along. The easiest way to do that is to take the line from the origin and go with the slope equal to the rise over the run. So for example, if you went out 7i and up 4j, you would get to a point 7, 4. So j lies along the line from 0, 0 to 7, 4. Or any constant multiples of either of these. So you could have from 7, 4 to 14, 8. Or from 0, 0 to negative 0.868.46496. Any two points that lie along that line will do just fine.